I'm gonna ride my bike today. I decided it's a beautiful day. It's gonna be 80 some degrees. It's gonna feel great outside. Ooh, need to lube that up. I haven't touched this bike in a very long time. I rode it a little bit whenever I was at my old house, but I hadn't really touched it lately, so it's kind of weird. Keeps popping for some reason. Yeah, my balance on this is absolutely horrid. I probably need to air up the tires a little bit more. I don't know if, it, if the tires are supposed to be like that or not. Maybe I'm just too fat for it, I don't know. I also need to figure out where my helmet is because whenever I move, I don't know if I grab my helmet or not. Yeah, I don't know where my helmet went, so it looks like I'm gonna have to buy a new one. So that's what we're gonna do. But first off, before I really get going, as I was walking out here, I wear flip-flops because I don't like wearing shoes because my feet smell bad and I, I, I don't like it. So uh, yeah, I was, uh, was wearing flip-flops and then I cut in between my toes and it does not feel good. I'm gonna blur it for everybody, but it didn't feel good. So now my foot is gonna be a bloody ass mess going up there, but I think I'm also gonna ride the bike up there because why the hell not? I'm gonna go somewhere where I think that it would be a good place to ride the bike because right now I was gonna go to the park that's right up the road from me, but there's too many goddamn people out there. There's so many people that decided that today was the day that they wanted to come to this park. And it may be the same place or same way at the other place, but at least it's to be expected. Here, it's just like, my God, there's too many people. But before I get going, I gotta air up the tire because this tire seems like it's a little bit low. Now, I don't remember exactly what it's supposed to be at though. 3.4 to 5.1 bar, whatever that means. But that's what I'm gonna do. And my little trusty air blower upper thing can actually get to that because it has a setting for that because this is made to basically blow up anything. Car tires, these tires, I love it. I love, I love the shit where you can just use the battery and it's good to go. All right, set the PSI, let's set it to bar. Okay, it says 5.1 bar. What, what are you doing? Grabbing stuff from in between my legs. Ah, get on there, yeah, there we go. At 1.10 bar. <laughs> Perfect. Oh yeah, that's a lot better. All right, let's get the other one just to be safe. It's at 1.3, what the hell? All right, 4.5. All right, they're both aired up the same. All right, so now we're going to get the bike rack onto the back of the car, so that way I can get the bike on there. It's been a little bit because I bought this and I only put it on once, and then that same night, because I was in a very sketchy part of where I used to live, they thought I was being weird and they pulled me over. And so to that cop, because I mean, yeah, of course I was joking with them, but to that cop, screw you. Um, I wasn't trying to do anything bad, but you decided to pull me over anyway because you want to be an ass. So, uh, yeah, up yours. Okay. I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to put it like this. And it'll cover my license plate, but apparently in my state it's fine to cover the license plate if it's a bike rack. It's not that big of a deal. So, here's that. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I think I remember now. I don't know why this has to be a convoluted system. But hey, it is what it is. It is what it is. All right. Ooh, something looks like it was getting rusted. Oh well. It does need some TLC done to it at some point, but it's fine for now. Got the bike on. 
kind of goofy because the front tire is so much closer to the ground than the back tire, but I mean, I don't really know exactly like if there's an easier way to do this. I'm just trying to knot it up so that way the straps aren't flying everywhere. Oh, hello. <laughs> All right. Bike's ready to go. Driving along, got the bike. Hopefully <laughs> nothing goes wrong with it. So far, so good. It's staying pretty well. But uh, yeah, I still need to go to the store and get me a helmet. I could probably just wear my hat, but I would much rather get a helmet. One thing I am irritated about though, is I had a little thing that you could strap to a helmet and I was gonna put that on the helmet that I'm going to buy, but apparently uh, I don't know what I did with it. I just had it and now it's gone. So I don't know. I probably misplaced it somewhere, but either way, I got a little harness thing that I could put on my chest for my GoPro. So that way I can show you guys what it looks like whenever I try to ride a bike that I haven't ridden in uh, way way too long i haven't ridden a bike in years and i had this one and well at the time it was a graduation present and it was in pieces and i was supposed to put it together but i never put it together and then it finally got put together and i never used it so now today is the day today is my time to try out everything the bike rack the bike all of the good stuff i just need a helmet first all right i got to the walmart just need to get in here, get a helmet, and go. Hopefully no one steals my goddamn bike. Oh, I would be pissed. All right, I got what I needed. Got to me a helmet, an, an adult Schwinn helmet. In fact, I think this is a, sh yeah, it's a Schwinn bike. So, hey, it matches. Of course, there's goddamn zip ties on it. I'm trying to bust the zip tie. Or maybe I'll just bust up my fingers. Got it. Yeah, it says adult 14 years of age and older, so hope it fits my fat ass head. Okay, so far so good. This would probably be easier if I wasn't sitting in the car, but I'm not going to get out and around all these people. All right, let's try that. Or Okay, yeah, let's try that. Oh, that fits better on my head. People are probably wondering, huh, this guy's probably special ed for putting a helmet on before he drives. Oh, there we go. I mean, that's tight as hell, but that's kind of what I want. All right, cool. Got a helmet. Perfect. Can I undo that anymore? Oh, perfect. Hang on just a minute then. All right. Now it's not incredibly too tight. I would assume I would pull those through. I don't know. But there, it's not too tight now. Perfect. All right. I got me a Dr. Pepper as well. And I also got me lead water, also known as Dasani. So... Should be good to go now. <laughs> Everybody in the comments who likes the Sony water. Oh my God, what did you say about the Sony water? It tastes like lead. It tastes disgusting. But that was only water that was there and it's cold. So that's uh, screw it. All right, pulling in. Oh, sweet. There's no one here really. That means I can get a spot in the shade. You may also be wondering, Jake, why are you parking backwards? Well, for one, the front end of my car is very low and I'm tired of running into the damn concrete barrier things that are at parking spots. Those things piss me off. And second of all, it's just easier to put the bike on and then I don't have to stand in the street. So why are you doing this to me? What is wrong with this stupid thing? Yeah, okay, I think I figured it out. I think I figured it out. All right, and then I can put the GoPro right there. Awesome. Now, where did the GoPro go? <laughs> That's the million dollar question. Oh, it's right here. Okay, hang on just a second. I think I found a flaw in my plan. I think I'm wearing this upside down. Because the GoPro, the way that it rotates, doesn't make any goddamn sense. See, it's supposed to be like that, but that's upside down.
carefully so nothing falls apart. Hey, that actually looks better. Now it's on my chest. Hell yeah. I like the way that this is screwed in anyway. Oh, that's perfect. Awesome. Time to get this helmet on. That way I can be nice and safe. Oh, I was asked, why do you need to wear a helmet? Is it against the law if you don't wear a helmet? Well, no, but I mean, I'm clumsy as hell. So knowing my luck, I would fall, get busted up. Then I'd have to go to the hospital. And yeah, it's just not a good thing. Oh my God, dude, I look so stupid. Oh well, it's it's ready to go. POV, you're me drinking a bottle of Dasani lead water. Let's see how it is. Wow, that's just bad. Just shoved it in the car. This is the first time I actually get to ride around in an area I wanted to ride a bike around at. Let's see what's going on over here. Whee! Had to turn up the intensity a little bit. It's a seven speed mountain bike with street tires. So ridiculous. See, if I didn't have street tires, I could go on that trail right there. That would be kind of cool. Oh, there's people over here. How's it going? Trying to record the nice weather. It's 81 degrees today. I want to be able to get some sort of recording done. I'm tired of just doing stuff on the computer every day whenever it's nice out. Might as well get out and do something that's worthwhile. Oh my God, it's hard to pedal up this damn thing. This is a driveway. This is gonna be interesting to see like what this GoPro sees. I'll probably ride up this because I'm pretty sure this ends up here. And I'll ride back and I'll go toward where the lake is. I just figured I'd see like the quieter section of this first. I can ride my bike with no handlebars. Woo! Hadn't done that in a while. I used to be able to ride a bike with no handlebars, but uh, yeah, that's frightening. This bike is holding up pretty well. Like whenever I aired up the tires, it's holding up pretty well. Oh God, there's a hill here. Oh hell, God damn. Maybe I could get up this hill and then I'll just take the roadway that goes to the lake. I'm gonna be that guy that rides on the freaking road. That everyone gets mad at. Let's do it. Oh, I made it up. Yes, I did it. All right. Oh, there you go, guys. I'm actually getting exercise. Fat boys getting exercise. This damn asthma is kicking my ass. Uh, we're not at a hill yet, god damn it. I want to be at a hill already. Whee! Yeah, see, everyone hates people riding on the roads, but it's like they put those bike things there so you can ride on the road. So kiss my fucking ass. <sighs> <clears throat> oh yes, a little bit of a hill. Thank God. Oh yeah, that's so nice. I'm in fifth gear right now on this bike. There's going to be a big ass hill here coming up. All right, let's go. I'm not familiar with the gears on a bike yet. I know the gears on a car, but I'm not too good with gears on a bike yet. Washing their car. Good day to do it. 
some point I need to mow the backyard again. The backyard is getting overgrown by grass again. <clears throat> I hear critters in here. <clears throat> we are dangerous intersection. That just means we're coming up on the hill and we are. Oh, thank God. Yay, I don't have to pedal. Oh, this is so much easier. We. That's going to ruin my brakes. <laughs> Woo! Oh, this is fun. And this is where I was originally going to go. Whenever I was going to go the other way. I just took the scenic route. And there's a lot of people over here today. Nice day for it. All right, let's go this way. <laughs> Hi. On your left, guys. Yep, always let pedestrians know where you're riding. So that way they can be prepared and then it's a lot safer there's the road but we're gonna take this scenic route right here as it goes back to the car I'm gonna have to do this more often one because I'm out of shape two because I can't just let my asthma win and kick my ass all the time I gotta keep doing this so that way I can get better about riding the bike. Oh, oh yeah, you gotta you gotta ride on these rocks. That scares the shit. <laughs> Let, let's try it. Let's try. Okay, hang on. <laughs> yeah, I got a little scared. <laughs> All right, we did it. I didn't die. Oh yeah, I rode from the road up there around to where I need to get back to. What's GoPro doing? Oh, GoPro's doing pretty good. This trail right here, I just gotta follow it and I'll get back to the car. I'm gonna try to go back over with the rock. That way I don't have to go through the swamp water. Wee. Do not fall. Holy shit. All right. Oh, it would be so great if there weren't so many goddamn bugs. Jesus, they are everywhere. They're hitting me. That's so crazy. There was one time I was going on one of those dirt trails and there was a lady that was riding her bike on them and she saw me and she was trying to miss me and she lost control of the bike and fell in the creek so I had to go help her. She was okay, but... That was a hefty fall though. <laughs> I felt bad, but at the same time, I mean, pedestrians can be on it too, so not my fault. But I still felt bad. That was a fun experience. Hey look, a bench. But if I stop now, I may not want to get back on the bike and it'll take me forever to get back. That only took me about 10 minutes. According, well, maybe like 15. I don't know, I thought it was like 5.10 whenever I looked at my watch the first time, and now it's a little after 5.20. That's nuts. I'm pretty sure we're almost there. Oh. I'm waiting for the one person to complain about the GoPro. 
I'm waiting on it. I'll blur people out if they want me to. But if anyone gets bitchy, they're gonna have a problem. Oh, thank God, back to where the car is. Yay. All right, got my phone, got my wallet, got my keys. I still have all my shit, thank God. Oh, I need to find some bicycle friends. <laughs> that way we can go on some of these trails together. I won't just feel like a fat ass recording everyone for no reason. Back to the car we go. <clears throat> Through the grass. We. Oh lordy. Okay. Gotta tighten it up. Same with this one, but where's the strap? Oh, there's the strap. Okay. I am shaky like hell, oh, dude. Holy shit. Oh, that's not my best tie, but screw it. It'll be good enough. That looks good to me. Oh, God. Get off me, you stupid thing. Oh. oh, God, my face is so red. Oh, beautiful lead water. Oh. Well, there you go. That was me riding a bike for about 30 to 45 minutes. I could barely breathe. I'm ready to go home. Hope you guys enjoy I'm going to have to do this more often. I'm probably going to do that. Well, if I could do it more often by like going to the park first thing in the morning, maybe that would be good. The park that's by my house. And that would probably help me out with being able to ride this thing a little bit better. But who knows? And it, if it's early in the morning, I could take my dog. As long as there's nobody in the park that's going to get offended. Get offended. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'm going to go back to recording from the computer. <laughs>